All right, good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. So for today's workout, you need two dumbbells, or if you don't have dumbbells, you know, you can use two cans or two waters. You can get creative with it. A water and a mat or towel, okay? So let's get started with a warm up here. Inhale up and exhale, reach for the floor. Feel that stretch behind your legs and your lower back. And then soften your knees, roll up one vertebrae at a time, and inhale, and exhale. This time, bend your knees at the bottom, get a little hip stretch in. Good, soften your knees, roll up one vertebrae at a time, and one more, inhale, and exhale, bend the knees at the bottom. Good, hands go on top of your feet, bend and extend your legs, get a little movement going on in those hips. Good, couple more. Get one more in, and on this last one, stay low, pushing the knees open with the elbows. There you go, yep. You can sway side to side, wake up those hips. Good, and then carefully come to standing. Let's get some wrist rotations in. Good, yep, make a ball with your fists. Perfect. And shoulder circles back. Good. And arms out to the sides. We're going small circles backwards here. Good. Start to loosen up the chest and the shoulders. Got some planks today. And forward, small circles. Good. And big circles backwards. There you go. And forward, opposite direction. And then just open and close the chest here. So we need those arms in front of the body. Good, yep. Get a couple more in. And hands on the hips. One circle each direction. And change, good. Yep, weight goes back in the heels, straight legs. Feel the stretch in your hamstrings. And one more here. Hands on the knees, couple knee circles in. Start to wake up those knee joints. Happy Friday, everybody. All right, opposite direction. All right, we're going into calf raises. So lift up on the toes and then roll back onto the heels, exactly. Good, waking up those calf muscles, stretching out your Achilles here, warming up your ankles. Got some stance jacks today. Get a couple more in. Last one. Step your right leg back, tuck your hips, squeeze your glutes, and reach over and pull down. Stretching out the side body here. Good. Good, warming up the lower back. Yes, get two more in. Last one. All right, step your left leg back, tuck your hips, squeeze your glutes. Same thing, other side. Reach and pull, good. Get three more in, two and one. Let's get some arm circles in. Loosen up those shoulders, might be feeling a little stiff this morning, that's okay. You'll feel warm in a couple minutes. And opposite direction. All right, let's go air squats. Bring the arms up by the ears. So we're warming up the lower body, also sneaking in some upper body in here, warming up the shoulders. Two more. Good, last one. And we're gonna go lunge and then twist towards the front knee. Lunge it back and twist. If you need to modify, you can squat and twist at the top. Just a couple. Good, let's get one more in and walk it out. We're gonna go into an inchworm with a hip drop at the bottom and walk it back. Here we go. Inchworm, cobra pose at the bottom, stretch out your back and walk it back. Good, you've got 10 seconds here. Feel that stretch in your hamstrings, your abs, your shoulders. Meet me in a standing position. We're gonna go into jumping jacks. Wanna get a little bit of cardio in before we get started. Really warm up those muscles here. Good. 
Start to focus on your breath. Warm up your lungs. Last five. All right, we're going jump squats. We're not jumping, you can go fast paced air squats. Or pulse it out. 10 seconds, use those arms. Yes, wake up those legs. Five seconds. And we're going burpees. We need to modify, walk it out, walk it in. Let's go 15 seconds. Yes, last 10. Last bit of that warm up. And resting everybody. Okay, I'm gonna grab my dumbbells. Grab your two weights. Today, each exercise will be one minute and then you'll get a 15 second break and I'll go over the next exercise. Number one, we're gonna go squat with a press up. Okay, we are here. If you need to modify, we can go just squats here or curl press if we're not squatting, okay? Let me set the clock. You've got a few seconds to get ready. Okay, we're going squat press in five. So you've got a minute. You can take breaks as you need them. You can take a quick rest and then get right back to it. Here we go. One minute. Good, yep. Nice, Gail. Good, deep squats, looking good. And press. Yes, there you go. So today we've got eight exercises. We'll get through uh, each circuit three rounds. So we'll do all eight and then we'll repeat it two more times. There you go, you're already halfway. Tana, those look good. Yes, if you need to modify, you can go just curl, press, keep going. Almost there, you've got 15 seconds. Okay, strong start, guys. The last five. Almost there. Three, two, one, and rest. Okay, now we're gonna pick up that heart rate. We're gonna get some cardio in. We're gonna go skaters. So glide across your mat, tap the floor, okay? We're not doing skaters. You can go curtsies or all fours, side kicks. Here we go. We're going skaters. So you've got plenty of time here. Zone in. Today I want you to find that mind-body connection. Skaters are looking good. Yep. Yes. Push yourself across your mat. Exactly. Eyes are gazing forward. Drop your hips. You're already 25 seconds in. Almost halfway. Yes. Hi, Debbie. Glad you could join. There you go. Woo. Awesome, guys. Halfway. Over halfway. Even better. Focus on your breath today. You guys are looking strong. I love it. You're going into your last 15. Yes, good, Becky. Yes, Jody. You've got five seconds. Lauren, keep going, looking good. You've got four seconds left. Get two more in, resting. Nicely done. All right, we're taking it down. We're going plank side to side, hip drops next. Okay, if you need to modify, you can go plank hold or on the knees, hip drops here, change halfway through. Here we go, plank side to side, hip drop. So pivot on those feet. Working those obliques, there you go. You guys are doing awesome. A minute seems like it's gonna take forever and then it's going by pretty fast. Good, yep. It's okay if your hips don't tap the floor. As long as you're using those obliques, that's okay. You're at your halfway point. 30 down, 30 to go. If you need to today, stop, take a five second break, rest, and then just get right back into it. 15 seconds. 
Yes, you guys are doing awesome. You've got 10 seconds to go. Yes, lots of bells today. Most of them will be insignificant. Last five. Resting. We're back up on our feet. We're going into a cardio move. We will be taking a stance jack, okay? If you need to modify, step and tap, okay? We can make it low impact there. Three, two, one, stance jacks. Here we go. Yes, there we go. Find a pace that you can stick with. This looks good. Good, I'm impressed. Good energy on a Friday. Yep, you are 20 seconds in. Staying strong, you're already halfway. Looking good, try to drop, get a little lower, get that whole hand to the floor. Yep, down and pop it right back up. Not the time to slow down, you've got 15 seconds left. After this, you're halfway through our first circuit. Yes, you've got 10 seconds. Everybody's going strong, last five. All right, three, two, one, and rest. All right, next move. We're gonna go, we're gonna start into a plank. You'll step it forward into a lunge and then bring the arms up, stretch it out, take it down, change legs, lunge, and reach. Okay, here we go. So lunge it forward, you can start in the lunge, reach up, stretch it out, lower down, and changing legs. So this is more of a mobility move here. Good, Scarlett Yep. Yeah, big lunge and reach, exactly. Drop that back knee to the floor, drop your hips, exactly. <laughs> Finding that balance. Good. Yes. Nice, Gail. There you go. Good catch. You're going into your last 15. Yes, you're starting to feel those quads here. No rush. Focus on the stretch. Good. Yes. Nice, Debbie. You've got five seconds. Maybe get one more in. Resting. 15 second break. So next move, we're going scissors, double stretch at the top. So reach for the ankle, two pulses, and changing, okay? We are here. If we need to modify, we can crunch and reach or crunch here. Here we go, scissors, double pulse. One, two, one, and two. So I want you to get a good burn going on in those abs. One, two, pulse it out. One, two. If you're feeling your lower back, you can always go into one of the modifications. You can always just go into a crunch since I'm not there with you. Good. You're halfway. Yes, reaching for the ankle. Stretch out those hamstrings. Exactly. Yes, this is where you start to feel those abs. Becky, great form over there. Good. Recorded version, you've got five seconds left. Get a couple more in. And resting, here's your recovery. You can always grab water during these breaks, okay? Next move, we're going into swimmers. So you're gonna be on your belly, lift up. We are swimming. If you need to modify for the lower back, opposite arm, opposite leg, or just a Superman. Here we go. Or you can go opposite arm, opposite leg. We are swimming. Straight arms, reaching through those shoulders. Straighten out those legs, point your toes. We've got one move left here, and then we're gonna get a longer break, by the way. Awesome start. Let's go swimming zone and squeeze those abs. Squeeze those glutes. Right now you're strengthening all those posterior muscles here. And breathe. Yes, I know this is a tough move. You guys got it. 15 seconds. 
Keep going, last 10. Yes, start to pick up that pace. Give me big flutter kicks, five seconds. Last three, two, one, and rest. All right, we're back up. This is number eight here. So we'll get a break after this minute here. We're gonna go reverse lunge with the bicep curl. Okay, so we're gonna work the arms and legs. If we're not squatting or uh, lunging, we can do just bicep curl or bicep curl with a squat. Here we go, lunge and curl. Squeeze those biceps at the top and then rotate those arms at the bottom. There you go, good. You're gonna build up a pretty good burn here. Just know that break is coming up in 30 seconds. You're halfway. Yes, there you go. Good, over halfway. Yes, make sure it's not a hammer curl. Let's go palms up here. Palms up, there you go, perfect. You guys are doing amazing. You have got 10 seconds left. I am impressed. You've got five seconds. Maybe get one more in and resting. Okay, here's your 30 second recovery. Feeling generous with the time, it might even be a minute. Grab some water. We're gonna repeat that circuit two more times here. Okay, let's go back to our squat press. Weights at the shoulders, feet are shoulder width, toes slightly turned out. Let me press the clock. All right, we're starting in five. Set two, here we go. So maybe this round for a little motivation, you wanna to start to count your reps. See how many you can get in without resting. There we go, good. Yes, you guys are doing awesome with the minute intervals. Squat and press. Perfect way to start your weekend. Happy Friday, everybody. Woo, let's go. You're 30 seconds in halfway. Good, get low in that squat, bend those knees. Sit low in that chair, good. Lauren, love those right there. Pressing right above the shoulders. Last 15. Good. Yes, enjoying this strength move. We got our skaters coming up next. Yes, give me one more here. Okay, 15 second break, set those weights down. Second move, we're going back into our skater jumps. Remember, if we're not doing skaters, we can go curtsies or all four side kicks. Three, two, one, start it up. Here we go. Yes, skaters are looking good. Keep the opposite arm up, here. There we go, exactly. Drop those hips, keep that chest up, smile through it, you're 20 in. Yes, focus on that breath. You're at your halfway point. Take it one jump at a time. Yes, if you can, you can start to pick up that pace. You've got 15 seconds. Doing amazing, yes, dropping those hips, last 10. Good, skaters, last five seconds. Yes, scale, you're on fire, one more. Resting, let's take it to the floor. We're going back into our side to side hip drops here. If we need to modify, we can go plank hold or hip drops here with the knee on the floor, okay? Or you can always go heel reaches. Here we go, side to side plank. Side to side. If these are too tough and you feel like you're really getting tuckered out, hold your plank for a second, catch your breath, and then go back into the hip drops.
Yes, it should be tough. You're burning lots of calories. You got it. And we're going into our last 20. Even better, 15 seconds. Side to side. You've got that longer break coming up in six seconds. Hold that plank if you need to. Don't let those knees touch the floor just yet. You've got three, two, one, rest. 15 seconds. All right, next move, we're going into our stance jacks. We're going back into cardio. If we need to modify, make it low impact, step in squat. Here we go. Start to feel those glutes and quads turn on. Looking good. Good, dropping those hips as low to the floor as you can. Yes, you guys are looking strong. Keep it up, you're halfway. Good pace here. Yes, mind over matter here. Let's go. The body achieves what the mind believes. 15 seconds. You guys are going strong. You have got seven seconds left. Almost there. Then you can shake out those legs in five seconds. Resting, recover. Grab some water if you need it. All right, next move. We're going back into our lunge with the reach up. So we're here at lunge and reach, changing legs, lunge and reach. Here we go. Good, one of my favorite mobility moves here. Good, yep, reach up, straight arms, open up the chest. There you go, good, Courtney, nice balance. Yes, these are looking much better this round. No rushes. The only time today I'm going to tell you to really slow it down. Focus on that stretch. Good. You've got 15 seconds left. Good. Let's try to get in maybe three more lunges with the reach. You got plenty of time. Let's get one more in and resting. We're taking it down to the floor. At the next bell, we'll go into our scissors with the double stretch. So reaching for the ankle, two pulses and change. If we need to modify, we can go crunches here or crunch and reach. Here we go. Yes, think about stretching out those legs. There you go. Perfect, way over halfway through with your workout. By the way, we've got two more moves here left for round two. Good, yes. Abs are aching by now. Embrace the burn, working for those strong abs we all want. You've got 15 seconds to go. Get a couple more scissors in. Two, yeah, good. Last 10. Stay focused, you're going into your last five. Yes, get one more in. Rest. Nice job, 15 second recovery. All right, next move, you're gonna flip it over. You're gonna be on your belly. We're going back into our swimmers, okay? If you need to modify, opposite arm, opposite leg, okay? Here we go. Yes, let's pick up that pace. Good, exactly. Sprint it out and then you can take a couple second break if you need it to reset. Good. 
key here is to really focus on your breath. Help those muscles out. Inhale through the nose, big exhales through the mouth. You're going into your last 15 seconds. You're already 45 in. Let's go swimmers, last 10 seconds. You guys are doing amazing. I know this move's not easy. Last five. Swimmers, give me three seconds. Two, one, recover. All right, we're back up on our feet. You've got a few seconds. We're gonna pick up our weights and we're gonna go back into the bicep curl with our lunge, okay? If you need to modify, we can go just biceps or squat curl. Here we go. Lunge and curl. It's going by quickly. You're already 25, 25 minutes in. We're gonna to try to get through one more round after this, and then we will stretch. We've got about, we'll see, eight minutes left to work. Hopefully we have time. Lunge and curl, good. You're 30 down, you've got 30 seconds to go. Yes, power through. We've got a 30 second break coming up in 15. Let's go, let's go. Yes, let those legs burn, those quads. You've got five seconds. You got it all the way to the end. Resting. All right, you've earned yourself a 30 second break. Grab some water, towel off. All right, for the sake of time, let's start in about 10 seconds. We'll go back into our squat press. Last round here. All right, let's go squat and press. Nice and low. Try to get your elbows to your knees at the bottom. There you go. Tap and press. Take it one rep at a time. You're already 20 seconds in. Yes, count your reps. It always helps here. There you go. You guys did amazing here. You're at your halfway point. Good. Squat and press. Good, yep. Our next move will be our skaters. 15 seconds to go. One more bell. Last five. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Get one more in. Rest. All right, set those weights down. We're going back into our cardio move. We've got our skaters coming up. Starting in five, three, two, one. Let's go skaters. Good. Yeah, this move is actually great for strengthening the knees. Jump, stabilize, jump and stabilize, good. For my recorded version at home, you can always go into your curtsies, okay? Or take it down all fours. We can do our kicks, okay? You got it, that clock is cheering you on today. You're 30 seconds in already, halfway. Making the most of it, we won't have these moves again. This is our last set. Yes, there you go. Last 15. Yes, good. You're going into your last five. Yes, keep those hips down, get two more in. Resting. All right, we're going into our last plank of the day. We've got our side to side. As you can see me, we're going back into our last side to side hip drops. If you need to modify, hold that plank. And here we go. Stay strong. You're looking at your last minute of a plank here. Yep. 
side to side, good. Becky looking amazing. You guys look strong. You're halfway. Good, using those obliques to lift and lower those hips side to side. Yes, pivot on those feet. Good. Let's go find, there we go. Yes, fight for it, you got 15 seconds. Be fierce here, you've got 10 seconds. You're looking at your last five, almost there. And rest. All right, we're back on our feet. We're going into stance jacks. You guys are doing amazing. We're almost there. We have a couple minutes left. Starting in five, we're gonna go stance jacks. And let's go stance jacks or squat and tap it out, okay? Stay with me. We have four minutes left to clap. Class, we're gonna be working up all the way to the end of the bell today. Good, stance jacks. Yes, woo, it's gonna be a happy Friday. If you can do this workout, you can handle anything today. Yes, I know those legs are on fire. This is it, one of your last cardio moves for the day. You're looking at your last 15 seconds here. It's okay to slow down, but keep moving. You've got 10 seconds. Keep jumping, last five. We've got an ab move coming up next. Resting, recover. Okay, take it down. At the next bell, we're going back into our scissors with our double pulse. We're starting in three, two, one. Here we go. Two, and change legs. Two, two. For the modified version, remember we can go crunches or crunch and reach, okay? Or any ab move that you're comfortable with. Yes, Lauren, those look good. Whew. Really reaching for those ankles. Yes. There you go. Halfway, good. This will be our last ab move of the day. Last 15, raise the burn. Almost there, last 10. Almost there, last five. And resting. All right, we're going into swimmers. We're gonna cut these last two moves in half, just 30 seconds for each move. And then we will stretch. All right, let's flip it over. Going into our swimmers, starting in five. On your belly, straight arms, straight legs. Here we go. We're going swimmers or opposite arm, opposite leg lifts. 30 seconds will feel much quicker than a minute. So we are sprinting here. There we go. Yes. Halfway, last 15. Swimming, swimming. Big flutter kicks. You've got eight seconds. Yes. Almost there, three seconds. All right, let's stand up on our feet last round of our lunge and bicep curl, whenever you're ready. Here we go. You're looking at 20 seconds of work here and then we're going to stretch. Awesome lunges. Last 10 and then we're gonna do a quick standing stretch at 6.35, by the way, if anyone needs to leave after this one. And resting. Let's go quick stretch, I wanna get those quads. You guys did awesome today. Yes, if you need to go, that's fine. Have a great weekend. And changing legs. Good, let's stretch out those hamstrings. So extend your right leg out in front of you, reaching for the toes. 
and then bend that opposite leg to get an even deeper hamstring stretch here. Good. And then changing legs, kick that left leg out in front of you and sink back, reach for the toes. And legs nice and wide, reaching through the center. Couple pulses here, stretch out the back of the legs. Good, make your way to standing. Let's finish with some neck rotations here. And opposite direction. And rest, you guys did amazing. Have an amazing weekend.